So the first performance benchmarks of the AMD Ryzen 7 4700G APU, which is also the flagship of the Renoir lineup, have leaked out. Now the latest benchmarks come straight from IT Cooker via XFastest SK unit, where the processor was tested for its multitasking capabilities. Now the benchmarks come just a few days after IT Cooker posted the first pictures of the Ryzen 7 4700G APU along with its CPU-Z screenshots over on its Facebook profile. The user did state that we will see benchmarks soon and they're finally here. Well, once again, the chip is the final retail unit of the Ryzen 7 4700G APU, so this is more or less the final performance that you're looking at. Now the CPU screenshot he provided also shows the Ryzen 7 4700G is based on the 7 nanometer Zen 2 core architecture. It features 8 cores, 16 threads, 4 megabytes of L2, and 8 megabytes of L3 cache for a total of 12 megabytes of cache. This is definitely lower than the 32 megabytes of L3 cache with the 8 core Ryzen 73800X, but due to its monolithic nature of the chip, which relies on a single package rather than the chiplet design, making the Ryzen 3000 Matisse series desktop processors. Now, another thing to note is that it is much more than the previous generation Ryzen 5. 3400G, so that's definitely a good thing to see. The CPU features a base clock of 3.6 gigahertz and a boost clock of 4.45 gigahertz, which matches the earlier specifications leak. The CPU operates with a 65 watt TDP and is compatible with the AM4 socket. The graphics side features an enhanced 7 nanometer Vega GPU, which comes with 8 CUs for 512 cores. It's clocked at 2100 megahertz on the GPU side, which makes it one of the fastest clocked integrated graphics chip. Now the performance of the chip is reported within Cinebench R20 and R15 multi-core tests. The platforms used was the ASRock B550 Tai Chi with 16 gigabytes of DDR4 memory in Cinebench R20. The CPU scores 5,102 points, while on Cinebench R15, the CPU scores 2,168 points. Both tests were carried out on multi-core scenarios. Comparing the score with the existing Ryzen CPUs, we see that the Ryzen 7 4700G is matching the performance of the Ryzen 7 3800X, which scores around 5,000 points in Cinebench R20 and 2,100 points in Cinebench R15 benchmark. The Ryzen 7 3800X is an 8-core 16-thread part, which has a TDP configured at 95 watts, whereas the Ryzen 7 4700G is an 8-core 16-thread part configured at 65 watts. The truly impressive for the Ryzen 4 series Renoir APU lineup. Now we've previously seen an overclock up to DDR4 5400 MHz and AMD's Ryzen 7 4700G with some really impressive memory latency and bandwidth results with the Ryzen 7 4700GE on the B550 and the X570 platforms respectively. The AMD Ryzen 4000 Renoir desktop APUs are planned for launch in the coming month, so we're definitely going to hear more about this in the coming weeks when AMD will also introduce its Ryzen 3000 XT Matisse Re fresh desktop CPUs. I, for one, am very much looking forward to the new generation of APUs and seeing just how much more performance they eke out over the last generation, along with the fact that they appear to be carrying 16 lanes plus four for the for an NVMe drop. So unlike the previous by eight line lanes that you were restricted with on the 3400G, which did hurt you in upgradability, it looks like there's going to be only the cache that you'll be left off the table with the choosing the new Renoir desktop APUs. I guess that's why they call it Renoid. For more on this and other news, follow the link in the description and make sure you're subscribed and hit the notification bell so that we don't miss you in the next one.